my name is John. Welcome to another SMC technical training video. During this video, we will show you how to set up an Ethernet IP JXC91 controller on your network with an IP address and generic Ethernet module. During this video, we will show you the equipment, software, and steps required. In the end, your PLC will be able to control the electric actuator using the controller. Let's get started. You'll need a PC, software, USB port, and Ethernet connectivity for communication. Be sure to check out the JXC91 hardware setup video first, then watch our JXC91 controller and software setup video prior to this configuration. Next, you can choose to set up the IP address manually or with software. Let's set the IP address manually first. Set the IP address with a precision flat blade screwdriver. Manual IP addresses can reside from 1 to 254 on network 192.168.1, which the user can set to any available address. Once set, reapply power to lock in the new address, then plug the network back in. We can check the status in RS links. Here we can see it as set on 22. As an option, we can set the IP address remotely with boot P. To establish communication between the devices, we're going to use local network 192.168.0. We'll use device manager on the PC to set the address. The PLC is already set and configured on 102. Then we're going to set the PC up on 101. Set the switches to DHCP mode with a precision flat blade screwdriver, or 255. Once the switch is set, apply power, then remove power. Convert to remote control mode by setting the three rotary switches to 000. Power back up, and the old address, 22, is no longer recognized. Now we can set the IP address from the PC. Start the BootP DHCP software. Once the BootP is running, apply power to the JXC91. Double click on the MAC address and enter the IP address into the box. We'll choose to 192.168.0 and we'll choose 30. Hit OK. Highlight the IP address and click Disable BootP DHCP. You should see Command Successful. To verify that all IP addresses are set, Start RS links and it will ping the JXC91 and other nodes to make sure everything is communicating. Now we will set up our Ethernet module. With the IP address, we're ready to hook up the PLC. First, download and install the JXC91 EDS file. Check the web page for more details. Let's start the programming software. First, make a project for the JXC91 and give it a name. On the left hand side under the controller organizer, right click and select new module. Now we want to set up a generic module, so we'll uncheck everything on the left side, go to the communication module, then choose the generic Ethernet module. In the new module table, enter the desired unit name first. Next, select the datacom format, then input the IP address set earlier. Now, set the input instance to 100, the output to 150, and the configuration to 105. Finally, set the fixed sizes to input 18, output 18, and 0, and hit OK. Let's look at step moving programming through the PLC. Go into controller tags. See the 18 inputs and outputs as created. After programming, we can see these outputs as an example with active values that control the actuator. So, let's check what programming was done. If you go into edit tags, we see that many tags were created for this program, such as this one for drive. Let's show this drive alias creation as an example. Type in drive. Then go in and find the JXC91 outputs and go to byte 0, bit 10, which we know we need for the drive bit. It is still available, so select that. Now save each like this into the program. Then run who active from the communications tab. Finally, download the application into the PLC. Let's now drive it to two different positions. So choose the position to go to, in this case 3, toggle the drive bit on, the actuator goes there. Going to position 0, do the same but toggle the drive bit off first, then on, and watch the move over to 0. Our actuator is now under the control of the PLC through the JXC91. We hope you found this video useful. Look for our next Ethernet IP JXC91 video where we will show you how to program the electric actuator in step mode.